I am so glad to be here with you guys. And I know so many of you guys are watching this online and you're from all over the place, but I think the majority of you are from Boston. I love it. I'm from the East Coast myself, from Yonkers, New York, and I am excited to be here with you guys. Thank you so much to Candace for reaching out to me to see if I would do this for you guys. And of course, of course I said yes. It's super important for um, me to help you guys get educated and learn as much as you can. I hope you've been taking tons of notes. So we're just gonna dive right in. We're gonna talk a little bit about the benefits of Ninja Red. Now, Ninja Red is one of those very curious products that oftentimes stay in the bottom of your kit when you get it for the first time because you don't quite know what it is. <laughs> so stop all that madness, you guys. You literally need to start telling people about Ninja Red because it is such an important part of the product lineup. Uh, literally, the majority of people who are on ER do Ninja every day. And it's not just them, it's their entire family. It's not a whole bunch, you take one shot, you can literally do one ounce a day and be good. But what is it all about? What are the benefits? Now, most people who have any, any sort of like health concern usually find that being on Ninja helps them feel more normal. Now, it's high, high, high in antioxidants. What that means is that anything, any of the free radicals that are in your body, which basically were being attacked all day long from all sorts of sources, <laughs> from air free radicals to electromagnetic um, fields coming into our system to the stuff that we're eating that is just messed up and the free radicals because we like to drink sodas and eat chocolate and things that are not good for us like sugar, all of that creates a plethora of free radicals. Free radicals are like little army guys on the wrong side of the team, okay? They're in your body wreaking havoc. Whereas Ninja, what it does is it comes in and it acts as a very high, Wolf Fairy is one of the highest, highest ORACs, meaning oxygen radical absorption capacity in numbers. And what it's doing is when you consume it, it's basically you're, you're, you're outnumbering the army. <laughs> you're, you're bringing in the forces. You're reinforcing your body. Your body does a really good job at oxi you know, taking care of oxidative stress. However, the reason that we age, the reason that we get wrinkly, the reason that we feel tired, all of this is because of an excess of free radicals. And so basically by using Ninja Red, it's getting into our system on a daily basis, that's the goal, and we are helping support our natural um, good health line, all right? And I kid you not, people who have issues usually feel much better on it and they swear by it. And so older people, like, hello, but people who are athletes, it's like a no-brainer to them. People who are just like every day, like we joke, uh, us moms, that at 3, that 3 p.m. lol, we're like, where's my ninja, <laughs> okay? So you can't drink too much of it. The problem is if you've not drinking it before and you do drink too much, so sometimes at some of the conventions that we do, they have ninja bars and and you know you pay for them but then towards the end of the end of the conference or something there's like leftovers so they start kind of giving out free shots so everyone's like I'll take more I'll take more so what happens when you drink that much it's kind of like when you overeat salad uh, and all of a sudden you find yourself on the toilet <laughs> okay so eating too many free ra you know ox anything that has high oxygen radical absorption capacity is going to actually flush your system really well and so you might end up with a little bit of a uh, you know faster moving stool than you'd like but uh, all that is is it's flushing your system out and it just means you're not used to it so occasionally i've done that before where i'm like at an event and i've i've literally drank maybe 8 ounces of the stuff and i'm like oh i feel good but i need to go to the bathroom <laughs> okay but um, knew, know that that's, that's what it is, and it's gonna keep you regular. So it's a really, you know, it's not gonna give you the runs, um, it's just if you overdrank it, because your body is now flushing. And so what does that mean? Like, why would you get the runs if you drank too much? Your body is, it's cleaning itself up. So when you drink the normal amount, like anywhere from one to four ounces a day, that's normal, your body is cleaning up. So you're gonna have these really good normal elimination sessions, <laughs> okay, these bowel movements that are good. But when you over drink, what happens is those free radicals are being attacked even more so and your body has more to eliminate and it needs to get rid of it fast. So that's what's happening is literally it's flushing your system out faster than you would think or that you'd like. So just so you understand, like the stuff works and that's why I share that kind of funny gross story because it works. 
And it's something that I am always on. My, my son gets a Ninja Red Shot every single morning. And just know that that helps his immune system. It has a very high ability to help support healthy immune function. And that's one of the biggest benefits of Ninja Red. The other thing just to leave you with is one of my all-time favorite, favorite things to do is do a Ninja um, Nitro. Now, I am fairly allergic to caffeine. However, the caffeine, it's a very small amount, and it's derived from, from I think, the cocoa bean or the chocolate bean. And it's small amounts of caffeine, but I don't do them every day. But every once in a while, what I need is some better cognitive fitness, and that's what they're for. It actually helps your brain focus better. So like if I'm going to do a long bike ride, I know I'm going to need a Ninja Nitro. Or if I'm going to do a long lecture ser series, I know I'm going to need a Ninja Nitro. It helps your brain fire better. And so those don't, you, you can take them every day, it's no big deal, but like if you're trying to get off coffee or something like that, it's good to start putting those in place of. But I love Ninja Nitro for sure if you're just exhausted and you're at that literal 2 p.m., 3 p.m. lull in the day and you're just like, I'm dragging and I still have a ton of work to do, pop a Ninja Nitro. So we have other things like Ninja Zing, which is super, super good if you like carbonated drinks. Uh, forget, you guys, forget all of those energy drinks. They couldn't be more unhealthy for you. You hear about heart attack after heart attack on what seemingly is healthy 40-year-old men all the time. And it's because they're drinking those too much because they need to stay awake or they're driving long distances and they can't fall asleep. Well, yeah, I'd rather them be hopped up on one of those energy drinks and make it to their destination, destination safely. But in the end, they're putting so much pressure on their cardiac system that they end up just having a heart attack and dying. And if you have a family member or a friend who is drinking those energy drinks, ask them if they'd like to try Ninja Zing. Just see if they'd like to try it. It's such a benefit, that or even the nitro. So it's something where you can get people off of these chemical, harsh, horrible things for their bodies that is potentially killing them, onto something so much more powerful and so much more healthful for them. It's not even funny, like it's, it's, it's a life-saving potential thing that you could be doing for your friend. So I encourage you guys to get on that Ninja. Just wanted to let you guys know that I have several books that are out right now that you may not know about. So one you also, you may know about, which is the um, Essential Oil Truth. That's to be able to give to anybody who doesn't know anything about essential oils and it's not a sales tool, meaning it's a sales tool for you, but to them, it's all about essential oils without the hype. I don't mention any Young Living information in there. It's very, very neutral, uh, but you'll see it's from a Young Living perspective. And so it will help them understand oils better. And then the French Aromatherapy book is basically a usage guide and recipe book for essential oil stuff, like how to make capsules, how to make like serums. And then I have a book called The um, Essential Oil Make and Takes, which is basically your, your, your invaluable tool to make a perfect make and take class. All the stuff that you do wrong <laughs> and how to actually make a, a good make and take class that's profitable for you. And there's over 60 recipes in there and those are make and takes. And make and takes are things like, you know, chapstick. Like how do you make a lip balm? How do you make deodorant? How do you make a whipped body butter? So these are all things that are super easy to make. I, I, I'm the girl that's like, I hate overproduction. <laughs> okay, I want things that are quick, dirty, and cheap and that work better than the counterpart. So that's that book. Uh, and then the other one is called Essentially Driven, and it's basically a book to help you uh, explain the business or hand it to someone and say, look, this is, you You want to do the business? This is a very easy to understand short book on how to do the business. So I'm excited for that. Um, it's out now, and you can go on Amazon and check that out. And then just know that um, you can always just pick up the EO Bar app, which is uh, super good. Candace helped me with that. and. Um, can't thank her enough, but just to know that that's something that is such a fun, easy, it's the app that I wish had been out when I started Oils, and I'm excited to have um, that in your hands. So, all right, you guys, I am so thankful to be here with you. I hope that you've learned a ton, and uh, we will talk soon. I'll see you guys in the Human Body and Essential Oils. Bye.